apalim apalim consists of humerus the bone of the upper arm radius ulna radius ulna the bones in the forearm eight carpal bones the wrist bone five metacarpal bone in the palm 14 phalanges the bones of the digits the adaptation of the human upper limb for movement through the wide range structure of upper limb is adapted for grasping weight lifting movement over wide range head of the humerus the bone of the upper arm forms an incomplete ball and socket joint shoulder joint in glenoid cavity in glenoid cavity of the scapula permitting a vast range of movement joint allows for flexion extension adduction abduction rotation circumduction distal end of the humerus has two articular surfaces distal end of the humerus has two articular surfaces through these surfaces the radius ulna articulate with the humerus at the elbow joint radius ulna ulna articulate with the carpal bones at the wrist joint radius ulna articulate with each other at the proximal and distal radio ulna joint The fibrous joint connects the bones along their shafts which stabilize their association and maintain their relative position in spite of forces applied from the elbow or wrist. Carpal bones which are arranged in two rows proximal row distal row are closely fit together so that there is a limited amount of movement between them proximal row bones are associated with the wrist joint distal row bones forms the joints with the metacarpal bones wrist joint is a present between the distal end of the radius three proximal carpal bones This arrangement is allows pronation supination pronation turning palm down supination turning palm up The proximal ends of the metacarpal bones in the palm articulate with carpal bones Their distal ends articulate with phalanges. Joints within the metacarpal and phalanges allow the movement of the fingers, permit the power of grip. Fingers may be extended, adducted, abducted, circumducted. First finger more flexible than the other. the joint present at the base of thumb between a specific carpal bone and the first metacarpal bone allows the more mob- mobility to the thumb than the other fingers this leads to opposable nature of the thumb this articulation permits position grip which is a unique to man